All right, back here with Jeff Mayweather, right from the scene of the crime. Jeff, people are pissed off at you for saying, uh, having the, the audacity to say that Anthony Joshua is not going to smoke Deontay Wilder if and when they fight. Well, um, <laughs> I don't think I don't think that, and um, and I don't even know if he thinks that. So you think Joshua might already be beat well, before the fight already happens? No, I ain't going to say he's beat before the fight happens. I mean, he got two hands, so he got a chance. But do I think he's going to win? No, I don't. Well, you know, I'm, I kind of, you know, reluctantly in agreement with you. I, I'm, you know, there's no bigger fan of Anthony Joshua than me. Huge fan of his. But um, I just, the more I look at it, I think that if they fight, it's basically a re repeat of Deontay Wilder versus Berman Stavern too. Why is that? I, <laughs> I think Wilder could because Joshua he's he's a little timid now. He's a little gun shy, right? He's he's a better boxer than Wilder. Sure, everybody's gonna say that, but the one thing you can't do is go in there and be timid and and uh, skittish against uh, Deontay Wilder. And Berman Stavern okay. found that out in the second fight, and I think that's gonna happen when they meet. Could be true. Come on, could Jeff, tell me you agree. First time being right. First Maybe. time, man. There's no one, like I said, there's no one, no bigger fan of his, and, and no one gets more right about boxing than I do, for the most oh, part. But shit. I, I think that's, uh, <laughs> hey, hey, I picked, uh, picked a lot of fights right, and I think that would be exactly what that would happen. You know, I, you know, we love our British fighters over here, but I just think that's going to be, you know, and the thing is, you know, people sit there and, and, and they said, you know, hey, oh yeah, of course they picked the American. Well, we both picked Fury over uh, Wilder. Right? Yeah. So, you know, the second and third fight, I think you picked uh, Wilder the first fight, but uh, um, we both, so so we're I not. Mean, I'm, I'm not afraid to pick anybody because whoever I think is better is better. Yeah. That's, that's who's better to me, so. Right. Well, we did the fantasy fight between me and you. You picked myself, which is because of the youth. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I would never pick you. <laughs> <laughs> But do you think, I mean, I, obviously so that would upset a lot of people, makes them mad, but, you know, I mean, the truth hurts, I think. And uh, Well, I mean, I just... Do you I think just, it's possible? I know you, you, you're you probably not going to say that, you know, but... Say what? Do you think, I mean, it could be a repeat of the Berman, the second fight? Yeah, I mean, it could. I mean, don't get me wrong. I mean, I mean, Deontay Wilder showed his punching powers, you know, is, I mean, it's incredible. And I mean, and basically, you know, and you can never really judge by one fight like with Helena's how how Wilder did him as opposed to how Joshua did him but but still it shows something you do know you, and do you think that you know do you think that he's become skittish and a little gun shy and if so how do you turn that around or is it once it goes it goes I mean he's getting he's not getting younger yeah. You know, and sometimes stuff happens in fighters, and sometimes they're never the same. You know, and I mean, I think that the fight with um, what's the 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 guy that just that, that took the title from? From who? Usyk. Usyk. Oh. U I think Usyk probably um is in his head more than anyone. You know, and I think that because I mean, when he, the way he fought Usyk was not how a heavyweight fight a cruiserweight. Mm -hmm. And do you think the same thing, like, like the second fight with Ruiz where he was trying to box him? Do you think, you know, and if he, so if he goes against Wilder, you know, worried about that power and he tries to box him, you know, and, and, and like I said, be a little well, gun-shy, not aggressive, well, that's not going to be the, that's a recipe for disaster. No, one thing, one thing about the Wilder is he's going to have to be able to withstand it because he's going to get hit. And if he don't, he has no chance. And that's that's basically that's basically it with with most water fights. I mean, if you can't withstand the only person that's been able to withstand it has been Tyson Fury. And just barely. Yeah, and, yeah and he, I mean, and even him, he went down. Right. You know, he's went down what twice, right? With when in two when, different fights, he went down. He went down all of them. I think he went down at least once in all of them. Yeah, and so basically, I mean, if you if you you know, I mean, if you are if you're not. I ain't gonna say you're not Tyson Fury because I mean Tyson Fury was the only one that would stand, you know, um, his power. So, and I haven't seen nobody else, and I've seen that um, the fight with Helenus. I mean, it's almost like he, he almost barely hit the guy, and the guy went down. Yeah. You know, and, and it took Anthony a long, a long time to, to get that same job finished. You know, but like I said, you can't judge each fighter by 
why how they fight one other, another fighter. But I do think that I just think that Wilder is the better puncher, and I think that he's gonna win. Got nothing to do with being American or, or anything else. I just think that he's the better fighter. All right, man. Not no racism either. Yeah, man. No racism. Yeah, sure ain't, white dude. <laughs>